while you're on probation, that in and of itself is a violation, right? Yes. And you were on probation because you'd been convicted of tampering with evidence? Yes. Had you? Yeah, I took uh, my friend's bag out of a uh, drive. When I was involved with the drive-by shooting, I took his bag that had a gun and weed in it. And took off running? Took it off to someone else's house. And they called that tampering with evidence? Yes. Yeah. Did you know there was a gun and drugs in there? I knew there was weed. I didn't know there was a gun. You knew when you were on probation that you weren't supposed to be smoking dope? Yes. So you could smoke dope and go to jail for a year. That must be some pretty good weed. Uh, <laughs> to, to say, I, I'm, a, I'm willing to do this and go to jail for a year. I just don't think before I do my decisions. So you don't predict the consequences of your actions? Exactly. I just love being involved with people that are dangerous. Do you think I'm dangerous? No. <laughs> I could really jack with your life, you know? <laughs> There's another uh, lie you just told. Lie. You can't tell the truth one bit. You are so confused. All you're doing is sitting here and lying. I'm done. And later... You don't take his help. Girl, you're going to find yourself dead somewhere. I don't want to bury my sister in a casket before I get married. You're my maid of honor. I want you to be there. I don't want to see you in jail either. Tomorrow on an all-new Dr. Phil. A killer at large. This guy murdered our girls. The chilling photos from the victim's cell phone. This is likely the killer. Absolutely. What is in the pocket here? The shocking audio recording. Did anybody in town see this person? Somebody knows who that person is. Was there any indication that there was a predator among you? That's tomorrow. Caitlin has two different Facebook profiles, the good one and the tough girl thug life as a gangster. Caitlin's good Facebook is normal, upstanding, middle-class girl. She then opened up this other Facebook page. She was holding guns up to her head. Caitlin was wearing a bandana and a hoodie. She is flashing gang signs with her hand motion. It is very troublesome. You say you don't lie, but according to Donna, you promised to go meet with your probation officer, didn't, said you had no bride to go, but yet she had offered to take you, said stolen video games were a gift, told police that uh, Bob had beaten you up. That never happened. Okay, I'm just telling you what she said. On Facebook that you got shot when it was a friend, not you. Never happened. That... Uh, you claimed that stolen money was just found, that you claimed that an outfit was not new uh, when really it was, you had purchased it with stolen money. You claimed that you found three necklaces at the pool, but really they were stolen. Oh, you forgot to tell the police about the backpack and told the producer you just didn't want to snitch. You told producers you don't wear hoodies anymore and you showed up in a hoodie. Uh, <laughs> I mean, what do, you, what do you got on there? Okay. Um, so, are these aren't these don't all these aren't all true? I never stole any money. Never bought stuff with money that was stolen. That was never me. I don't lie. I have uh -huh. not lied. My mom is always, but she even said I took her Vicodin. That never happened. Don't start saying that because how am I going to steal your Vicodin if I'm out in the streets? Explain that. Go on, explain it. I will explain it. One of your drug tests that failed, um, your probation officer called me and said that they found marijuana and a controlled substance. And marijuana I, is a controlled substance. Excuse, excuse me. And they said, do you take any pain medicine? And I said, yes. And he said to me, that's probably what it was. That doesn't make sense because when I, was on, when I went to the doctor for my finger, they put me on Vicodin, so go on this and go was on. before about. the Vicodin, and you were also going to no, the was. ER getting pain pills so you wouldn't have to have a drug test. Never had pain pills. I only had the Vicodin for my finger. That was only a few weeks ago, so go on and keep lying about it. Did you take your sister?